Let's try to see how we can remove spaces and what is the use of this uh, remove spaces and what, what is the business need to remove uh, spaces and some of the examples uh, just to understand this concept more better. Uh, the first thing is what is the need of the uh, need of removing uh, the spaces. Uh, so whenever the data is not available in the proper format, uh, where the source data comes in a wrong format and having spaces before or after the data. Uh, this is one problem maybe in the source data. So at that time, we need to have uh, this data properly formatted without any spaces. So let's try to see an example. So where we do have this uh, co particular uh, company name and location. And uh, here you can say after Google or this Microsoft company, there is uh, some space. So here there is some uh, more spaces has been added. Uh, when it comes to combining these two fields, you can see this has been uh, the space has been concatenated like this. So this after this uh, Google and Microsoft company, there is uh, extra space as well, which comes after that. So uh, this is not uh, looking good and we need to have this properly formatted, remo removing that space. So this is something which is we can do with the help of SQL functions and uh, how we can do that. Uh, though. There are uh, uh, two things, uh, which is, uh, as you can say, this is one column. Uh, uh, this is one query where we have done this. And you can see this is uh, something which is for the after city, there is some space uh, for these two rows uh, where it is coming. So we need to properly format this. So how we can do that? Uh, we can uh, actually use the stream function, which will just remove the spaces before and after uh, for that particular city. So you can see in this Frankfurt uh, city, there is uh, no space now here when we execute this query. So this is one thing uh, we can do. There is a L trim and R trim as well, left and right time trim. Suppose we just wanted to remove the left side uh, space uh, so that we can do with the left L trim as this, uh, this example is showing. Uh, when we use L trim, then you can see the space is not removed because this space is at the right side. So in this case, when we use the R trim, then this space has been removed because that space was at the right side. So this way we can use, uh, depending upon the requirement, both of this uh, we can use, or if you wanted to trim the space from both the sides, then just use a trim function. So in summary, we have seen how we can uh, remove the spaces and uh, what is the need of that and uh, the examples uh, uh, how to uh, remove that. So we will try to see this practically as well now. The previous session, we have seen how we can concatenate uh, different columns into a single column where uh, we have actually combined state, uh, city, and zip columns into a single columns where it is giving some, uh, the values with the comma separated. So that is something which is a kind of address, which is uh, we can uh, say uh, we have created one uh, column. Now, think is suppose there are some uh, like uh, data uh, or the raw data which is coming from different sources maybe in an out of proper format uh, or there may be some spaces now if, if you can see uh, this data which is uh, available here the, for the city uh, here first three rows which are there uh, are in a proper format uh, but this frankfurt or uh, louisville these two cities are uh, having some spaces in uh, in that so if you try to copy this uh, somewhere, then you can see this is copied like this in this space. But uh, if you just copy this particular city, uh, then it will not uh, copy. I mean, it will just copy that. But if both of these uh, cities, if you just try to copy, and then you can see uh, this has been copied like with the spaces means that means it contains the spaces as well so uh, and uh, whenever we have such data we need to make sure that the data is in a proper format or in proper quality way uh, because it, it it will be going to use further for further processing of the data so it should not give any any error or uh, any any misleading uh, information so that is something which is we need to correct for that we have to uh, basically remove the spaces and how we can remove the spaces. Now uh, we, I am just uh, having this concat function. So what we can do here, uh, we do have this state. Uh, let's say uh, we wanted to remove the space from this uh, city. So what we can do, we can use this stream function, which is uh, uh, remove the spaces from uh, before and uh, after. So this is something which is uh, it can uh, do. And if you just try to run this, now you just observe this uh, two records. Now it is coming with uh, after Frankfurt, there is a space and uh, there is a column. That is something which is uh, due to that space. But if you try to run this, uh, then you can see this uh, space is not there. And uh, this particular, uh, for both the two rows, so there is no space and they are coming properly. So this is something which is uh, we can uh, see. Uh, there is another function which is, uh, now I'm just uh, have just reverted that function. There is another function which is uh, L trim and write uh, R trim. That means 
uh, trim will actually uh, trim the space from both the sides, left and right. But if you just wanted to uh, like remove the space from the left, uh, then we can use this as L trim. Uh, and if you just try to run this, then you can see this uh, because uh, there is this space is on the right side. So this is not removed. But if there is a, any space on the left side, then it can be removed. Uh, but uh, you can just make sure means uh, if you just try to remove the R uh, uh, right side uh, space, then we can use this R trim function and uh, you can just see means if you use that, then it comes properly. So this way we can do if you are not sure means uh, where is the space or then you can use just a trim function. But if there are some requirements that they wanted to have some spaces on the left side or uh, maybe on the right side, but then um, or you just wanted to remove the space from just one side either left or right then you can use left or l trim or right uh, r trim so that is something which is we can use as per our uh, requirement so this is the way we can uh, remove spaces uh, from any of the columns uh, just to make sure that uh, the quality of the data is good uh, because that is going to be used for, for further processing so this is one of the functions which we can uh, use for this i hope uh, you liked it and i will show you next session